Welcome to this introduction to jQuery video course. My name is Craig Buckler and I'll be taking you through the world's most popular JavaScript library. This course provides more than 60 videos. There's over six hours of tutorials and every section has demonstration code that you can view, modify and copy for your own projects. There are also exercises to test your knowledge. And finally, there's a full set of completed code which you're welcome to adapt for your own projects. The course has been created by a web developer with more than 15 years experience in the industry. It'll help if you have some knowledge of HTML, CSS and JavaScript programming, but the course covers many of the basics. As well as learning about jQuery, you'll also discover useful information about HTML5, CSS3, the JavaScript programming language, and web services developed using server-side technologies. So in this course, you'll discover what jQuery is, where you can obtain it, how you can include it in your pages, and the situations when you should probably avoid it. You'll also find out what development software you need to use, which web browsers you should install, and the testing and debugging tools which will make your life much easier. And the good news is you won't need any expensive packages. In fact, all the software you need is free. Now the tutorials are designed to get you programming immediately. You'll be introduced to the library, the terminology and techniques such as chaining. We follow this with a series of videos and exercises about CSS and CSS3 selectors. We start with basic selectors and rapidly progress to more advanced techniques. Now this is one of the most important concepts to understand when you're programming in jQuery but it will also help with your knowledge of style sheets. The next set of tutorials introduces you to one of the more fun topics, and that's animation. You'll be shown how to use basic techniques, such as hiding and showing, fading in and out, and sliding up and down. You'll also learn techniques to build your own custom animations. We follow this with an explanation of how browsers render HTML pages, and we introduce you to the Document Object Model, or the DOM. You'll discover many ways to examine, modify, copy or remove HTML elements, attributes, form fields and HTML5 data. We'll then discuss web browser events and how you can interact with user actions. This can include mouse clicks, button key presses, form submissions, page scrolling or any other interaction with your web page. We'll also discuss efficient techniques such as event delegation. This is then followed by a discussion of some important jQuery utility functions which will help in your day-to-day -day programming tasks. We then take a look at Ajax. We discuss what Ajax is and the combination of technologies you need to make it work with jQuery. A variety of sample programs is provided and is built step by step. We then discuss how you can write jQuery plugins. With a few simple steps, you'll be able to extend jQuery's core functionality and create reusable components which will work in any web application. In the final sections, we pull everything together and create complete jQuery-powered applications. This includes a reusable HTML5 tab control and even a full HTML5 game powered by jQuery. Finally, we wrap up with a set of online resources which are essential for any jQuery developer. I hope you find the course useful and I appreciate all your feedback. My name's Craig Buckler. Thanks for watching.